was over crypto muscle coming to you in a YouTube video. Here we are in an action right now worldwide sending kids where it's at crypto muscle in the crypto muscle network. Coming to you in another video. Alright, so let's take a look over here. You know I consider Overdome a legacy. I think it just it has the makings and and the ways of a legacy platform and uh, the players involved in it and what we got going on over here uh, it certainly has wheels and legs behind it uh, in terms of being a legacy platform and can it go for a long term? It could possibly can just because Overdome you can earn up to 1% daily right? up to 1% daily so that's what's interesting about it and there's no guarantee that a platform can you know sustain for that long it can but uh, in theory but you just never know right so this is Overdome all right and when we look at what Overdome has to offer they offer in the form of software licenses and do trading on your behalf and these are the licenses here, right? So 50, 100, 250, 500, 1,000, 2,500, 5,000, 10,000, 25,000, 50,000, 100,000. So, you know, it's your typical license or packages, however you want to call it, of, uh, you know, a way to earn and play. And you're going to earn to you double, uh, triple, to you hit 300%. So triple what you put in, for, for example... Let's look at what I have here. I have $1,500 in licenses, right? And with these, they're going to earn until they triple. So 1,000 will complete at 3,000. 500 will complete at, uh, you know, 1,500. So all in all, 1,500 here is going to add up to... Uh, Let's see here, 15 plus 15, 3,000, 4,500 bucks. That's tripling right there. So what am I going to do? Well, I'm just going to play that thing out and see if I play my cards right, I make that next step in the progression. All right, and that next step in the progression would be $2,500 gold. All right, so we're going to see and continue to make the next step. If, if it goes along really well, and continues to just push forward and and uh, stays consistent, then uh, yeah, we'll keep we'll just keep rising up in the packages. That's all. That's the way I've always played it. Uh, I don't like to throw heavy money into it from the get go. Um, it's just way too risky. I, I just can't do it. I can't bring myself to do that. Uh, some people can, but I can't. <laughs> and there's a lot of people that fake it all right so you could tell it's so easy to see that people fake that um, deposit of you know let's just say a hundred thousand dollars not very many people can pull that off all right in general and willing to take on that risk and then you got the dick bags out there that think they can or I try to act like it but they're not fooling nobody all right so um, and me being a realist here, all right, um, just being real, all I got to say is that there's not too many people in the space that could do that confidently, like very little, very minority population. And being that I'm a realist, I put in realistic deposits, right? You know, $1,000, $500, that's typical. That's just what I usually put in. And I'm comfortable with that. You ask me to put... 10,000 I'm proven no sorry rarely would I put 10,000 very very rarely once in a blue moon for sure uh, if if not at all right and I'm talking about from the beginning and for me in every platform that builds over time and continues to maintain consistency would I what have I always increased my deposit over time yeah for example, CashFX started that at 500 bucks. 
And by the time I got to the end of it, towards the end, my last deposit was $30,000. Because I made the progression up over time. And look how long that lasted. It was good and paying a steady uh, two and a half years. And so um, that's what happened there, right? You can look at Cuba Life, right? Cuba Life. I, I increased my deposit over time on that one too. I started out with a thousand dollars on that, and Cuba Life. I think by the end I had I think twenty five thousand as my deposit into that platform. Um, when it all came to the end, Vortex, same thing. I mean, I, the list goes on and on. I always like to start small because the risk for me is minimal. And then that way, if the if the say they go sideways and goes away or they screw you over, you know, like I could name, for example, Aladdin bot, right? Because of my upline, whatever reason he had beef with my upline, Aladdin, that they took it out on all of us. So I said, you know what, screw them. But at least my deposit wasn't huge in that thing or else I'd be super pissed but I explained all that too about what happened you know so it's things like that that happens and like I said I'm a realist alright and always keep the shit real so that's what we got there you're gonna earn on just the profit alone three times back right 3x on the affiliate side you can earn till it's four times that amount so for example just on the affiliate only not it's not even including profit you could earn four times what you put into it all right so that's pretty interesting how they go about it that way all right and I guess they could differentiate what's considered a commission and then put it in for you so you know it's interesting how they have a little cap there but the cap is necessary because sometimes commissions can go crazy. So they're limiting limiting those commissions to four times your deposit. So you know what that means? If you know you're going to have big time commissions, you might as well just go for a big deposit into the platform, right? So that's how that works if you know you have big commissions. All right, so just keep that in mind. And so... Uh, Let's see here. Got a lot of numbers here. Fourteen dollars in the deposit wallet. I have fifteen hundred dollars trading, and then I have uh, seventy-two fifty in the earnings wallet. Deposit. I don't even know if I could take that out. Fourteen dollars. I don't know where that came from. Yeah, because you can't take that out of the cash wallet. This can only be applied to, I guess, future deposits. So, it's all good though. I guess we'll put in a uh, $25 minimum for withdrawal. We got $72.50 here. Let's do it. $72.50. That's from Earning Wallet. I don't, yeah, so you need $25 minimum. I only have $14 from Cash Wallet. So, Earning Wallet, boom. Let's confirm it. And it's now pending there. You can see. And uh, will I be able to select cash wallet? No, because you need at least $25 minimum, which I don't have. So, yeah. And it, and it comes in a timely manner. You can see how it's been consistently in that range. That's fine. I don't, I don't mind that at all. Consistency is key to everything. And if it's, if it's just doing that for months and months on end, I'm actually cool with that. You know, just keep on paying monthly like that. Shit. <laughs> you know, why not? All right. So, um, kind of in a nutshell, that's what Overdome is, all right? Uh, laid it out on how this is, where it is, how to go about it. It's on the MetaMask here. And, um, Yeah, we'll just see what happens with all that. 
So yeah, pretty, like I said, pretty straightforward stuff. And you can see there, earning wall is down to zero. That means the withdrawal has been conducted. And let's look, look at the trading history here. So December, 12.8% uh, for the month. And then January, man, look at that. 21.41% for January. And then you look at uh, February, it's only been a couple days and look at it, it's already off to 1.69 start, which is again, not bad. So uh, yeah, check it out, you can earn, they say around 1%, up to 1% daily on it, but uh, we'll see, you know. And then you can see here the progress, it's uh, roughly halfway. As soon as that meter hits here, you get a $50 bonus, right, for a career bonus. Let's take a look at that. See what we got here. Damn, look at that, World Diamond, shit. All right, so that's where it's at with this thing. I just want to give you guys an update. Uh, while I'm here, I want to do a checkup on uh, my DH life here. All right, so this is what I got going on here. I put a $2,500 package. I've withdrawn 2704. No other pending packages. Uh, some of the deposits and packages purchased. Like I said, I only purchased one package, the $2,500 package, and went from there. And uh, what you get out of it is really good, <laughs> a really good deal. Uh, let me see here. Uh, let's see, where is it? Here it goes, products. Well, these are the products I'm getting because I went with the Kingdom package here. All right, but yeah, let me show you guys that. Where is it at? Purchase package, marketing, DH Life. Hmm. So I guess I'll just roll it down this way. With the $2,500 Kingdom package, this is just outlining what I have. They're getting you a travel portal. All right, global discount directory, and then in the mail the other day, they sent me like four lessons <laughs> on um, this stuff here that I'm going to mention now that I haven't looked into yet, to be honest. So, um, you know, you can see there what it looks like. Uh, how to establish a belief system, cause pages, Fortnite Mexico resort certificate. Interesting, right? All inclusive resort certificate, seven night resort family of four certificate. Another lesson here with Blockchain Master. Another lesson here with uh, Introduction to Global Business and Intro to Financial Management, Healthy Aging Wellness. All right, so these are um, what you're going to get with it, you know. And then lessons that go with it as well. And look at this, even more stuff. Airfare plus two nights hotel for two. Cruise certificate, two tickets to My DH Life First Conference and uh, My DH Life Dinner. So there's a lot of gift that's in this thing. To me, pays for itself, you know. So that's where it's at. Take a look at this though. You got you could take a look at the marketing system they have. You could take a look at the video content here of my DH Live, and this is from the CEO. If you want to check out those videos. Get connected with the community, information board, all that stuff, all right? There's a lot of good things here with my DH Life that I uh, just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, there's not much to it with an update. They're trying to start their own community chat away from Telegram because just the amount of Telegram toxicity that's been going on. Uh, that looking to go like on an independent community line uh, that's really off of IX Global and uh, YouTube and all that. So, 
just saying getting away from all that stuff all the neg negativity all the other BS that goes on out there and so that's what we got here just wanted to just quick run by I haven't talked about my DH life in a little bit uh, I think minor changes that they've done for example is withdrawing of funds if you're looking to withdraw you have uh, Bitcoin Cash App Vel, Zelle, Bit, Venmo, Stripe is coming soon, and then Bank ACH processing times 48 hours. Bitcoin withdraws are processed Mondays and Tuesdays, and um, the Bank ACH is only available for U.S. members only, which is interesting. Uh, and the big thing is that submission deadline for a smooth process: submit your withdrawal request by midnight on Saturday before the first and third payout weeks. All right. So, seeming to try to give you guys a little bit of that. And if you put in Bitcoin, you get out Bitcoin. If you put in these things, you're gonna get it out in cash if you put in, in these type of accounts for deposits. Uh, but if you started with Bitcoin, you're going to get Bitcoin out, and that's how that's going to work. But yeah, I just wanted to share this with you guys, like I said. Uh, and other than that, if there's any updates or anything, I always share with you guys anyways. So other than that, comment down below, links down below, subscribe to everything I got for everything I got going on. And I'll see you in the next one.